The luckiest students in the world. No, that was a joke. I should start the video like that. <laughs> Ignore that, pretend I never said it. A maths teacher in the United Kingdom in a place called Manchester. Manchester, la. yeah, I'm from Manchester. 30-year-old maths teacher, given the name Bunda Becky. Great alliteration, by the way. She wasn't their English teacher, but whoever their English teacher was needs a raise because that is some exceptional alliteration. By male pupils in the school is found guilty of having, I, I can't say the word, having a bone session with two 15-year-old students after trying to blame the illegal relationship on everything from from being lonely to them controlling her. I mean, look at that picture there. They've caught her in her absolute prime. She must be so happy that this has been released to the public. I mean, firstly, don't rape. That's some good advice. Probably some good life advice. Never done it and I never will. Why do I have to clarify that? You just have to clarify. You have to be careful these days. Like, you know, when you Twitter by, you have to put not a fascist just to confirm that you're not a fascist, not a Nazi. Don't mind LGBTQ plus minus divided times. You know, that sort of stuff. But Bunda Becky, let's delve in. Like she delved into her students. <laughs> Jesus. A maths teacher has been found guilty of sleeping with two underage pupils in Manchester. 30-year-old Rebecca Joins, who was nicknamed Bunda Becky. <laughs> Bunda Becky. I can't get over that fucking name. Oi guys, have you guys got maths next? Yeah, we got Bunda Becky, boy. You got you got Bunda Becky too. Oh nice mate, we're gonna have a great year. Let's hope she doesn't touch anyone again. <laughs> and later became pregnant with one of them. She took- Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my- So I was reacting like, imagine getting pregnant with a 15 year old. I mean, you, you're in deep shit, bro. You better have that fucking abortion app downloaded and ready to rumble because that shit needs to be deported. Now, look, my opinion on abortion is I don't have one. It's up to the other person. You know what I mean? It's women body, women rules, whatever, what have you. But a 15 year old kid, I mean, that is rough. That, you know, you've got no choice. You can't drop that thing and say, yeah, hi mum, hi dad. Yeah, well he's 16 now it wasn't when it fucking happened obviously it's only you as it should be best student by far that's debatable kill me so she's she, it's known that people were burning bunda becky in the spare time that's just tragic embarrassing like that is well known you know when you talk about that like you had that one teacher pretty sure he's a pedo i'm pretty sure he's a nonce he probably wasn't a nonce but he just had a funny look and you know wore a weird coat and some circular glasses or something like he's harry potter on his way to azkaban like my god but to actually then say that's debatable about the bet oh but you can't blame the students that you know I mean, I feel like 15 year old kids, they don't know how to control their fucking penis. No way, Jose. And you know, Bunda Becky's got Bunda Becky for a reason. I mean, goddamn, goddamn. Boy A, who was 15 at the time shopping, and bought him a £350 Gucci belt before having with him at her apartment oh my god so blackmail basically 350 you know this guy got everything a bit of a thumper in <laughs> he got some humping done instead of humping his pillow and and he got a 350 pound gucci but i mean what's the problem here i'm not i'm not I'm, 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 I'm just kidding look if the revolves were reversed this man would be a fucking bigot because it's a woman with a student everyone's kind of a bit like that's kind of funny actually that's okay. kind of funny you know but it's not it should be despicable but i i admit i'm finding this kind of a bit like I don't know how to react. You know, if this was a man, I wouldn't have made the video because it's disgusting. But because it's a woman, you know what I mean? Maybe I'm the problem. Well, I'm definitely a problem. I don't like maths. Get too distracted now from the work because you're looking at Bunda Becky. <laughs> Hey, Bunda Becky, sure, it's the Bunda. Better had be the word. She needs to take an English lesson. What's that mean? Of course it is, miss. What else would it be? Good. She was suspended from her job and arrested after the boy's allegations came to light. Whilst on bail, she began another relationship with a 15-year-old boy, Boy B later becoming pregnant by him for be oh my god so she's just committed a triple homicide and then gone and shot six more my god you know to be arrested released and then do it again like that's that's an illness that's a problem you know what i mean like it's a, it's disgusting it's disgusting you know what i mean and fair enough i i'm sure you know young ladies they wanted to tell their friends and you know but they're not to blame the woman is to blame to do it again is a absolute <laughs> really you know the police have got around some questions here they released her on bail i suppose you pay the bail but she got released and then committed again. The second time, the court heard that she invited Boy B to her house for a date night. At the end, she showed him a baby grow, saying best dad on the front. The jury found Joins guilty of six charges of engaging in sexual activity with the boys, including two while she was in a position of trust. Holy shit. You're going to be a dad. Like, that's psychopath behaviour to show that to a child, a kid, and go, you're going to be a dad at 50. So Mom, I need help. You know, I'm sure his tune fucking changed then when he saw that. He's like, this was not fun, actually. This was horrifying. The worst experience of my life. I mean, it would be rightly so. Like, imagine that. You, 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 you get raised, basically, by 
someone known to the school as Bunda Becky, okay? And then, or manipulated, right, whatever you want to call it, by a person in power and person you trust. And then she whips out a baby uniform. Bitch, please, I'm not even past my exams. I don't even know how to divide yet. You've not even, you've been distracting me for two years. I have not worked out. You know what I mean? That's an absolute joke. Imagine. Yeah, you're going to be a dad. I'm fucking not. I'm not. Like, that's that was the final nail in the coffin. I mean, that's psychopath behaviour, though, innit? To whip that out and sort of imply, like, this is yours, baby. It's like, no, it's not. I mean, what was she going to do? She wasn't going to keep the thing. You know, was she? Was she going to keep the thing? Probably not. I mean, half her age, 13, 15, whatever age, that's just wrong. You know, imagine a, a 50-year-old boning a 100-year-old grandma. I mean, it's just wrong on every single level playing field ever isn't it and it's even worse when it's your fucking teacher look i know i've made a few jokes but this is not a joking matter it's very serious but like i said before because it's a female maybe i'm sort of a bit like this is kind of fucking hilarious but then to bring out a baby uniform like you're gonna be a fucking dad whether you like it or not is crazy crazy having one night stand with 15 year old pupil then got pregnant by a second boy she broke down in tears boo hoo you she today found guilty of string of sex offenses parents run a successful tea room in an upmarket part of wirral Wirral. I'm from Wirral. I won't go to bloody Will on Wirral on holiday. Moved away from a messy breakup to start her dream job at school. So she had a messy breakup and then thought, you know what, I'll take it out on a 15-year-old kid. Fair play. But after being bombarded with comments from boys in year 11 Masco about how sexy she was and in the name of Bundy Becky, which is slang reference to her bottom. Thank you. Thank you, the Daily Mail, for all the oldies. She invited one back to a luxury Salford Quays flat. <laughs> Nothing luxury in Salford, let me tell you that for free. She was arrested and suspended after rumours of an illicit fling. Raisley went on embarking a secret sexual relationship with one of his classmates. Oh my god. It was fan exposed after she confessed to the second teenager, to whom she wrote a love letter saying each and every inch of you is perfect. Ah! Oh my god. And that she's pregnant. Oh my god. I mean, she looks very cheerful there. <laughs> Before she was found guilty... After she was found guilty, oh, her father was there at least to back her up. You know, you got to respect that. I mean, she doesn't look like that in that picture. You know what I mean? Years before she, you know, did the deed. When her baby bonnet tucked into her waistband of a... Ch she later denied that this was wind symphony, but they were not... I mean, that's psych this is a psychopath. This is a crazy psychopath person we are dealing with. I would love to have a conversation with her lawyers and tell her, ask her what she thought. Yeah, there's the Gucci belt again in old uh, the Trafford Centre. Old oh, Trafford's falling apart. Old oh, Trafford is falling down. Da, 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 da. Damningly, he told police it had dawned on him that he'd sacrificed 18 months for a paedophile. Brutal. She just basically mentally abused me. See, that's it, isn't it? She, she would have got in his head thinking that this is exciting. There was a 15-year-old. It's easy to manipulate you. You know what I mean? If you tell me that the flat was the earth was flat back then i fucking believed you bro i'm like yeah I, I why wouldn't it be flat dude it's fucking flat intractable problems of her daughter's impending birth so is she still preggers she's still dropping a kid off i mean is it the 15 year old kid Ugh. anyway enough of this bunda becky and bunda becky papa i mean she looks fantastic in that they've really caught her in her prime what do you guys think of bunda becky i think we can all agree she's a, de a degenerate however however i like how she you know despicably was trying to blame the students as oh i was alone this, that, and the other. Bitch, shut the fuck. You know what I mean? She's paying the uh, victim card. What a what an absolute peasant. And I'm glad she's been caught. Let's hope she's never allowed out of prison again. And yeah, that's it for now. Let me know what you guys think. I mean, it's despicable, isn't it? Like I said, I made a few jokes here and there, but it is despicable. If the roles were reversed, it would, you know, I wouldn't even be making a video. So what does that tell you about me as a person? I'm a fucking scumbag.